Hi Sprinkles, welcome back to Storytime with Mommy. I'm Mommy and this is... Me. Who's me? Also known as Mirabella. Mirabella. Thanks for joining us. Make sure you hit like, subscribe, and, and hit, hit that, that bell. bell. And if they, if they want to keep in contact with us on Instagram, where can they find you? And our channel. Mirabella underscore TV. Very good. And become a member. All you have to do is hit join on the link below and check My out merch. our merch. Merch, 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 We got Turtle Turtle Watch Out merch. That's the title of the name. It's that's the title of the book, Turtle Turtle Watch Out. <laughs> yeah. We don't have any merch for this yeah. book. But we do have the book, and we are going to read it with you today. It's called what again, Mirabella? Nice and loud. Turtle, turtle, watch out! This story is by April Police Sayer, and it's illustrated by Annie Patterson. It's a very cute story. So if you have a copy, Sprinkles, grab it and read along with us. Late one night on a beach in Florida, a baby turtle story begins. It could be a short story or no story at all if not for helping hands. Turtle is only an egg now. Her mother's flippers cover her with sand. Hungry raccoons watch. And when Mother Turtle crawls back to see, furry feet scurry, noses sniff, paws dig. Turtle, turtle, watch out! Young hands holding a flashlight scare the bandits away. They place wire mesh around the turtle nest to protect the buried eggs. Morning comes, so does a jeep. It speeds toward the eggs. Turtle, turtle, watch out! The jeep stops. Hands have put up a painted sign. No driving on the beach, the sign says. The jeep leaves. The turtle nest is safe and undisturbed. Turtles sees, I'm sorry, turtle sees none of this inside her egg. Two months later, turtle begins to tear her leathery eggshell. She rips it open with a special tooth. She rocks and wiggles to escape. Then she rests, still half in her shell. Her yolk sac attached to the bottom of her shell shrinks as her body absorbs its energy. A day later, nudging and pushing, she and the other hatchlings dig toward the surface. They scramble, then rest, scramble, then rest. Their upward journey takes three whole days. Finally, on a moonlit August night, Turtle peeks out of the sand. Other hatchlings below her are pushing her upward. All around her, the hatchlings dig out. Pushing against the sand, Turtle crawls across the beach. Go to the light. That's all Turtle knows. At night, the brightest light should be the horizon over the sea. Tonight, it is not. Turtle crawls toward the wrong light, shining across the street. Turtle, Turtle, watch out! Small hands switch off the light. Turtle turns and crawls the other way. She scurries toward the ocean waves. Step by step, she journeys down the beach. Animals gather, night herons, cats, and raccoons. They are hungry and are here to eat the hatchlings. Turtle, turtle, watch out! Quickly, Turtle scoots to the water. Whoosh! Water picks her up and carries her seaward, then pushes her back toward the beach. Whoosh! Waves tumble her tiny body, then carry her to sea again. She pushes her flippers. She can swim. She swims past hungry fish. Currents catch her and carry her far from shore. For months, she drifts in patches of seaweed. She dines on tiny plants and animals. She grows. Currents carry her thousands of miles, circling an ocean wide until one day she leaves the floating sarcasm, a mass of algae. 
She begins to swim past islands, past sailfish, past humpback whales. She reaches a coral reef where she spies a tasty jellyfish. Turtle, turtle, watch out! Splash! Plastic. Quick hands dip down, grabbing the plastic bag. It looks like a jellyfish, but it is not. It could choke a turtle or clog its belly. Good thing they were there, right? Dude, one day I want to team up with Team Seas. Yeah, and help? I want to help clear the seas. Turtle swims onward. She looks for other food. As she grows, her jaws crack open conks crabs and clams. For 20 years, this is her turtle life, until one day she feels restless. It is time for her to travel far and fast. She flaps her flippers like underwater wings. She swims and swims past ships, sailing and sunken. Three sharks see her. Turtle, turtle, watch out! The shark's pursuer, no hands can help her now. She swims faster and faster and finally escapes, but she does not see a shrimper's nets rushing toward her. Turtle, turtle, watch out! In an instant, she is swept into a net. It drags her down, down. She needs to surface to breathe. The boat pulls tumbling her to the back of the net. She is almost out of air. When she slips through an escape hatch, she is free. Months before, weathered hands had sewn that hatch onto the net, just so sea turtles could escape. Shaken but safe, Turtle swims on. She meets a male turtle, and they mate. Later, under a summer moon, Turtle swims toward the breaking waves. Oh, no, you know what those are on their shells? Those are called barnacles. Oh. They're other living sea life yeah, that gets stuck like to their shell. Yeah, they can because they are in this similar shape. Thud, her heavy body hits the hard shore. It is the same beach where she hatched, but now things are different. Now she is a mother turtle about to lay her eggs. One day those eggs will hatch. The tiny turtles will begin their journeys, scrambling across the sand, and some will make it with a little luck and fast-moving flippers and the help of many hands. And at the back of this book, Sprinkles, there are some helping hands for sea turtles information about um, not only the seven different types of sea turtles that there are, that are in danger of extinction, but there are also a list of probably like 10 different ways that people are helping all across um, the United States and globally on how they're helping the sea turtles. And at the back of the book, the dedication for Pearl and the Richardson Turtle Team for all sea turtles and for all those who help them. Thanks for joining us, guys. Bye. Bye.